Um, okay, I want to say hi again, everybody. Hello. In this video, I'm going to be doing some more art. Okay, so let's see what we can do. <coughs> um, really, I want to start off with some silhouettes again. I don't know. It's just a, a format that seems to be working well with me right now. Um, I think what I'll do is I'll start with a greyish colour, full opacity on the brush and we'll just do a few uh, a few shapes or something I don't know what it's going to be yet but it's going to be some kind of shape. what I really would like to do is make a, a painting I've been trying to come up with some concepts for a, a painting anyway um, I don't have a clue what I'm doing and if you want to do a painting this is not the best way to do it this is not at all the best way to do it it depends I mean well, there's you know, different ways you can do things but you know, you can go in this way with lower opacity. The only thing is, then it's like I don't, I don't like to do this straight away. It's a, it's a way of creating noise. I think they call it, isn't it, noise? Right, but the thing is, the reason being is because it's like it's all over the place. It doesn't make too much um, sense. I like to, I like to work with this stuff later on when we do like shading and stuff. So I, I usually go with a full opacity brush. But, as you can see, you know, it does, you can do certain things, you know. You know what, it really blows my mind how, you know, you can still, I don't know, man, I really don't know, like, is it, do you start with a sketch, or do you start with a, you know, do you start with a sketch, or do you start with just going in and painting, or, I have no idea. different things you can do um, so you know I'm coming in here because I don't have a clue really what I want to do it's just uh, some random thing here see so. Almost, uh, I'm trying to find my way around this thing before it exists. It's like so weird. Okay, image, hang on. Here's your image, uh, flip. Oh, okay, I'll flip this way. Oh, no. <laughs> you know, don't know why I did that, but something not working there. Okay. Okay, let's see what we can do. Ah, now I'm seeing something actually. If I change the perspective a little bit, I can see certain things. Okay, let's go on here now. Quite a few layers going, I'll say that. Which is like something crazy. It's like sometimes you have images where they're like so, um, so bad, like to start off with, you know so there's nothing there and then later on you'll be surprised something will just jump out of you and just save the day the image saves the day <laughs> you know it really does so I'm trying to hope that's gonna happen this time I don't know I'm just hoping for the best you know this is going to be cool. Okay, so you can see we've got some like bridge setups here, right? I'm sure you can kind of work out I've got that kind of thing going on now, right? Okay, so you've got that going on. So it's a painting. Okay, I'm trying to do go for one of these like, um, you know, what they call it, uh, you know, um, um, from chaos. What do you call that? From creation, from chaos. Um, concept art kind of inspired designs okay what I'm trying to go from here okay okay go for that so we put all the different layers on yeah see what I can come up with okay this is somewhere up higher these these buildings are up kind of high um, whatever they are uh, under here kind of dark and we've got some rock Formations maybe going on over here. 
it's really hard when you're painting I feel because it's like you gotta I don't know what it is you gotta when it tells you to sketch it tells you to sketch and when it tells you to paint it tells you to paint it's a it's a really weird thing and I'm just trying to get grip to grips with it myself you know it's like these are gotta like go into the distance all these other weird shapes and stuff but you can see how it does actually talk to you <laughs> it's talking to me anyway you can see this here and the, and the more detail you have it just comes at you and starts talking to you it's, it's a really weird thing like that. I don't know what to say so I'm going to put some more bigger uh, lighter shapes in here if that made any sense to you Oh, hold on something just happened there I don't know what happened there I just oh chose the wrong thing okay here so I want to make it feel like it's um, you know high up as such but there's maybe water down below maybe you know um, things like that okay so it's really rough looking you know go in and pick colors as we go in to you know just uh, work this thing what I'm gonna do is something crazy I'm gonna merge them all as one layer merge it all as one layer now it's just crazy right to the contrast a little bit didn't really need to do that but whatever you know so the contrast a little bit there okay let's go and put some more little details and stuff and we can do it either way I can work with the darks or the lights okay uh, you know. okay so I'm gonna go in with some dark areas here so I've got to put some people and stuff in them, things like that as well. Okay, so. Put some people here, you know. Put some weapons and stuff, maybe like samurais or something like that. You know, okay, so they're walking along. Put some guys there, yeah, okay. And I did that all on one layer that so you know. you know now I'm working on one layer very dangerously I don't know what I'm doing here I've just made a mistake and did it all on one layer but you know I'm just gonna do it that way put more people here more in the distance maybe okay more about um, over here There's some maybe some guards or something up there guarding this place whatever it is it doesn't matter too much. We're still at an early stage, you know. Since I'm putting these details in and stuff, it doesn't matter. I'm going over stuff. It does not matter at all. So I'm just trying to work it out. Okay. Still trying to work out what is going on. Okay. It's dark under there. We don't know exactly what's going on anyway. So. All these little accidents and things happen, this is true what they say, you know. See all these different little shapes I'm doing here, look, it's like, most like these are structures in themselves, you see. And uh, it's just this crazy, it's just crazy scene. Yeah. You know. Okay, so I don't know how that happened. You know, I just accidentally chose another colour. The, the, the brush did it by itself almost. I, obviously, I clicked on something by accident. I messed up there, but I don't know what that was. But, um, yeah, we're going in. Okay, so I've been doing this now for however long it's been. Um, you know, it's been um, 10 minutes-ish. I've been making this working on this image already for nearly 10 minutes okay and um, it's coming on right slowly but surely you know and, um, yeah I do love to do these but um, I don't do this kind of thing often and I think you can see why I'm not very good at it. <laughs> okay, I'm going to put some uh, 
little things up here, some kind of stuff to hide my terrible art. <laughs> nah, uh, and you see how again, you see, see what, how that's actually helping. You see, actually putting these dark areas. Sometimes when you feel your picture is looking a bit dead and you just can't see what it is, what details are you missing? What is it you need to do? What you find is it's just a, a question of the light and the dark. You sort of let light and dark uh, details and things. The light shows the dark, right? You know, and the dark shows the light. So. That's what it really is sometimes, that's all it is. But, uh, yeah, it's looking kind of, as I say, on this bridge here, it's looking very, um, you know, very uh, bland, isn't it? You can see the colours. It needs some light, doesn't it? It does need some light on there. You know, so, I'll give it some light then. You know. Lighter areas. You know, dark where needed. You see, uh, things like that. See, these little details sometimes bring out a lot. You see, don't know what this thing is here, just something hanging down. Okay, we're going to have some fun now with the water here, if we can. There's water down below. So we are going to do that. Let's clean that up. A bit, a bit of the water. Okay. Water! <laughs> I can imagine people laughing at my accent for those people in other parts of the world. You know, whatever. I don't care. I don't care. It's my mouth. And I can use it however I want. Yes, it was fucked up, cuz. Okay. So here we go. Put a bit of, bit of, bit of water in. Oh, I mean. Bit of water. That's there. Okay. You've got to make changes as you see fit. Okay. So, like, a bit, bit of reflections here, see? Not exactly the same, obviously, but certain reflections, it just brings that in, you know. Um, a water line, they call those water lines, you know, there. Um, a bit early, you may say it's a little bit early to have there. Water lines and stuff, see. Lines to show the water, the water blood. Okay, <laughs> okay, water blood, water. Okay, now we're gonna have some dark areas here to show more detail. Geezer, 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 one piece. He's a bit of young one piece, but not that I've ever seen that cartoon in my life. But. Okay, now before we move on, we go on, move off. <laughs> now before we move on, I'm putting a few details in as you can see. Shading as I go, you can shade as you go as well, putting some shading in. You know, put some other details in as well. I mean, you don't, you don't have to stop with details, you, know, you can just put other things in, like look here, see. I see I could put a few little things in like this could be like something tied onto there maybe a rope or something you never know a bit too dark I know but you know go over that okay, anything like that see just put some lines in a bit more dark on this bridge on, on these uh, steps sorry few things here like some more weirdly placed railings and stuff something there hanging down actually it looks like his ropes going into this direction now doesn't it so I guess you could do that 
There's some uh, some ropes there, maybe something like that hanging down. You know, some other things we can do other things too, like this, and put some sticks to give idea of the perspective and stuff. You know, put those people in the distance and stuff like that. Through a few little trees and stuff over there. Even you could have that come a bit lighter in the distance, obviously. What we're going to do is we're going to make this into something big. Right, okay, hold on. Now, what we're going to do from here is we're going to give it a bit of a blur. Like a maniac, like I am. It's not always good to just add blurs and stuff just for the sake of doing it, but, you know. Um, okay, playing with the contrast a little bit, see what that does. Not a lot of justice there. <laughs> can do this, bring it into some kind of... Some kind of sheet. No, leave that. Okay, hold on, we can adjust that slightly. The levels, okay. Now we're going to go with this, play with, so I've got to duplicate that. No, hang on, before we do that, oh, okay, okay, I will, I'll, I'll duplicate that, du duplicate, duplicate that and make a, oh, now that's looking better when I play with the tones. Now that is looking better, right? A bit more realism there. I'm going to go with the, um, you know what I'm saying? Do a soft eraser. Just like erase various parts. Now, this is something I was no way expecting at the start of this, okay? So, I like it when the magic works. Don't you like that when the magic works? I oh, can't get enough. I just can't get enough. Ba -ba -ba -baby. <laughs> you know, so you're doing a few shapes there shapes here and you get your shit, oh, you get your shit popping. Now, carefully I'm going to put some light on the other areas like here, you see. It's going to be darker, to walk more closer towards us and more lighter the further away we go. Remember, that's what the rule is usually. Ah, shit. Made those, I made those motherfuckers glow right there. Make my motherfuckers glow. That power range doesn't make my monster grow. Make my monster grow. <laughs> the fuck? She said, make my motherfucker grow. Okay. Don't worry, we're gonna work this just this shit out, shall we? Bang. Now I'm gonna make a uh, what, a lighter version or a darker version? Probably a Okay, well, hang on. Go with that. Forgot what we got now, hang on, we got a darker and a lighter, okay, hmm. Merge that down, hold on for one second. It's coming together. Just let's come together right now. Oh yeah, in sweet harmony. Do you know that song, guys? What an awesome old track. Let's come together right now. Haha. <laughs> strange but anyway okay, now I'm gonna go in and it's just playing with these lights basically just erasing area that's all it really is just erasing to show various areas and you'll either do it wrong or right that's what I've noticed you'll either do it wrong or right in certain places go for no. you know when I start to add color and wait till you see the effect we get yeah Okay, it doesn't have to be so dark. I mean, I didn't want this thing to be super dark. I wasn't. I always get this thing where my pictures always end up looking like really dark because I play with the contrast so much and stuff. And you know, so, yeah. Sorry, the camera just cut off there. I was just saying, like, you know, I always come up with it. I always uh, end up with like pictures that sometimes look a little bit too dark and stuff because I'm working with the contrast so much, you know. But um, whatever. It's coming on. It's coming on. See, sometimes when you go with that super strong contrast, it doesn't always, always do it justice, you know. Ah, see. You've got to work with certain things. So, if I do this, okay, if I do... Hmm. So, I could do that. See, it, it looks okay with like, the contrast, but the thing is... 
it's not right, you know, it's not it's not totally right. If I do this, okay, if I do this then and start playing with the uh see we're trying to save it the best way I can. The best way I can. I'm saving it right now. Bring it up bring it up bring it up. Hmm. Okay, if I bring that down a bit. Yeah, 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 that's what I'm talking about, see? If I go there and I start to... Now I've got to paint in some shadow, basically, is what I've got to do. I'm just basically erasing areas now to just reveal the, what's behind it. So, trying to create some more shadow without dis destroying the image, as such, so to speak. Just putting more details in as I go as well, you know, things like that. Putting more details in as I go. Okay. See, like, as I go a little bit here and there. You know, I think what we really need to do is start adding some colour now. Sometimes you can get it carried away on the detail, I think. That's what it is. But what I can do is I can start choosing some colours. Excuse me. Uh, start adding some colours there. Uh, start, I start adding some brighter areas there I should say. Okay. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. Like that, see? And again like more lighter air very lighter areas too, like even like lighter areas. You know. You can do that as well. Um, okay. Uh, more painting, more painting, like here, see, more areas, more lighter areas. See, it's like it's too in the dark, I feel. It really is too in the dark. You know, depends how you look at it, though. Depends how you look at it. Okay, so that's coming together somewhat nicer. Okay. I like these stone things, whatever they are at the bottom there. Bottom right, no. I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to merge those down because otherwise we're going to mess this one up, I think, because it's like kind of just the way this one is. Um, you know. I'm going to go here, I'm going to take some um, very light grey and start to push things back slightly, you see, by doing that, that helps a lot, just, just by spraying on a soft spray there, it's not set to a particular blending mode or anything like that, it's just literally just painting it over with some transparency, and that's helping a bit, see, certain areas, you see. Okay. Well, you know, once that's done, we can uh, kind of, um, you know, then move in with some other other things. So let's see what we can do with the tones now. It's still, it's this this picture is just still very dark, and I think it's just the way I've done it. It's just making it look so dark. But you know, it, it's okay. But I'm gonna go at it. It's just the way it's turned out. I think this one. But, you know, at least this is looking somewhat more realistic, you know. I mean, if you look at it that way, look, I mean, in some way, you know, it's looking all right, you know. In some way, I mean, just in terms of the um, brightness and stuff there, let's see that. This little bit here, shining through, you know. And again, you know, you can see like there's more light on that side. So I guess what we really need to do maybe is have some more see light to show where the shapes are and things like that. Uh, we need to show shadow, I think. A bit more shadow or something. We need to show a bit of that as well. Yeah, you see. Okay, it's coming out. It's coming out. Okay. Somewhat, it's coming out okay. Somewhat, it is in the mist as well. 
what I'm saying. Uh, but I think, you know, <clears throat> overall, it's coming on all right. All right, do you know what I mean? I'm in the fucking main, main, I'm in the fucking main. <laughs> you know, um, a bit more detail here on these figures and stuff without messing them up. Give him a weapon. <laughs> oh, that's wrong. That was the wrong part there, so... Okay, this guy here... Okay. Okay, that's that. Now... Get a light, lighter areas and stuff. Okay. Okay, good. So we're getting a few details there to make this make these characters stand out a bit more. So okay, so you know that was certain amounts of light See, on these stones and stuff. Oh, excuse me, went straight across the guy's legs. Okay, that's that. Okay. Yeah, that's going to be that, really. I'll put a bit of a glow type fog there around these people just to make them stand out a bit more. And again, across these bars here. Stuff like that mist. It can be like mist, it can be seen as mist, even like you say. Misty areas and stuff. Gives to the effect mist around there you see when I put it out I start to add the colours on you'll see what I mean okay okay so here we are okay um, it's coming on okay sort of thing contrast play around with that a little bit I think we're okay with what we've got so far to be honest with you um, I will however duplicate and try one more time with the curves and things see what we get okay so just seeing what we've got here okay uh, using a soft uh, erase uh, there and, uh, you know trying to bring out as much realisticness as we possibly can <laughs> it's amazing the amount of uh, detail you can bring out and just by sketching like this and then using you know what you have with some a few brushes and a few play around when you play around a few times with the uh, contrast and things like that you know it's just a quite amazing it really is okay so that's going to be that I think for the most part Bring that, yeah, you see how I bring that like that lighter there, slightly lighter, and then with the contrast here, can you have okay? See, the more if you have too hard contrast, it's going to end up looking not very realistic. What I'm going to do is I'm going to add a color grade now. Are you ready? <laughs> the moment you've been waiting for, maybe. Um, yellow, go on top. Go for a multiply. The other way maybe. Well how about just a sunset? Red and yellow. But mind you I do like the green to be honest with you, don't you? The green and the, you know. Right, we'll go right, we'll go for a blue and a purple, how about that? A blue and a red. Let's see what we can do. Should I go with that? Okay, ho okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Go for colour, colour first. Put that down. Go on top. Go with some random. What? Red, yellow. Let's see what we can do. Multiply. Alright, I'm going to go with that. Go with colour. Go with the saturation. Bring that right up. It's not perfect, it's not perfect given. Put the brightness up. It's not looking amazing, but here we go. 
you know, turn the saturation down a bit, I think. Play with the hue, maybe, a little bit until we get a different feel. Okay, how about this? How about this? We can play with the uh, tone curves thing one more time, maybe. Totally destroy it. <laughs> no, we don't want to destroy this. Excuse me, I nearly just dropped my headphones there. Never drop your headphones. Okay, now, um, so it's coming out pretty rough. But still, we did something today. And it's what we got. I just could do it. It's just a case of just constantly messing it up until you get something good. Okay, hold on. Let me go with hard light on that. Ah! Hmm, hard light, huh? No, 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 it's not that good at all. Okay, how about this? Just a case of just trying all different kinds of things. Okay. Now, overlay, oh, it didn't work. Green waters. Hmm. This is a really strange one. This. I think this could probably work. This one. How about like that? Uh, <laughs> now we're nearly done. More color. More color. And then more color. Not too much. <laughs> I think we're basically nearly done. I think we're just going to leave it like this because uh, I've got to do more pictures tonight. So I'm just going to leave this like this, I think. Okay. It's going to be what it is tonight. That's just what it's going to be like tonight. We're going to go with a quick blur, slight blur on there to hide all of our atrocities, <laughs> mistakes, so to speak. We're just going to go with that, I think. Uh, save it as that because it's not going to be too much better. Go with some mist, got a little bit of mist on there um, to bring out some lighter areas and stuff like that, maybe. So, and that will have to be that, I think, because it's not going to go anywhere else. Bit of contrast. That's probably going to be it today with this one. I don't think there's any much more else I can do with this one. You know, but it's been fun doing it. I'll say that. Let me just save this one out and say thank you to you guys for watching, okay? Um, you know. And what I will do is I will uh, just have a look at that image quickly. And uh, thank you for watching. Okay, let me just check it out. Okay. Full on the screen there. Okay, there we are. So, you know, it's not the best, but what do you expect for a quick sketch, you know? That on the right that you're looking at is another image I did earlier on. You know, but um, it's a video I'm saving for you, another video that I'll show you how to make that image, how I made that image on the right side of the screen there. Sorry about the um, triangle. <laughs> Big thank you to you for watching this. Talk to you again very soon. Thanks.